Today, we throw O'Hare Ashenil into our wild card challenge. Step one of the strategy is to get damage in early. Cacophony Scamp or Kamado faces Kakazan, lead the one drop push, while the two drop is reserved for damage spells such as a braid and lightning strike. Step two of our strategy is to get O'Hare Ashenil down and start casting spells that deal damage to our opponent, such as play with fire and in the festivities which can be turned into a board wipe if played correctly now there's a little extra surprise within this video we're switching things up so you may want to stick around so you don't miss it now enjoy the matches So next turn is the Raptor, but okay, play that. Uh, that. Swing, and then we'll play the Raptor. Hopefully we can draw into something to set up for the Ash Neil. And if not, I mean, hopefully the Raptor sticks around and he can do some damage on our turn if they try to do something crazy. Just gotta see what opponent's playing here. Is the next play. Okay. We get the festivities, so hopefully we get to make use of it on this play. If Ashenil sticks around, it does. Oh man, this is about to be sweet. swing if they block it they they're not gonna block it they need that bet oh they block it burn down the village deck yeah sure we can call it that does does the raptor go bye bye goes bye bye okay Ooh, we don't have enough to do it. All right, let's hold the Stoke the Flames. Uh, sure. Need a land. We get it. Technically need another land, though. <laughs> Yeah, we gotta hold on to the stoke the flames. Um, let's pray we get another. Okay, we get the land. Is this? Oh, this has a sorcery. Okay. All right, that's fine. All right, that applies to him as well. And I think he's starting to realize it. <laughs> Let's see what he is he gonna pass like what's happening oh he's thinking about crewing but if he crews he has to sack this right yeah when this attacks he has to sack something so i'm imagining he sacks the sensor okay oh it's a may ability trash I have to do four damage. Oh, it can be the okay. All right, let's do it here. 
Oh man, we were one, um, one mana short. That sucks. Uh, opponent? Are you still with us? Because if that goes bye bye, we can cast the Kamano. another Kamano. That's all we can do for right now. Alright, so... Alright, I'm just going to cast another Kumano. This is hilarious right now. Alright, let's swing first. Let's see if they got a removal. Yep, that's fine. Need something big. They've been waiting on something. They don't get it. I'm assuming this is another removal spell. Nope. Alright, we get in. Alright, we have enough to flip the freaking god now. But we just need something to do it. That's not it. Alright, we get in for two. In turn. Yeah, right? <laughs> the abuse. They need to actually activate that token in order to be able to prove that for two, right? Alright. So we're in trouble. Unless we can find a way to flip this stupid god. <laughs> Come on, Dad. I mean, their deck's not all that great, to be honest, because we shouldn't be in this position where we can still possibly win. Uh, they got a second play? Oh, okay. Ah, they get the Mondrak back. Okay, let's see how this plays out. We hold. I mean, the only good thing is it has trample. Not the best thing that's got going for it right now. All right. You know what they should have put on here is an activated ability to do four damage or whatever. That's what they should have put on there. Uh, okay. Hopefully we get something good. We need something good. Stoke the flames. Ah. Uh, man, you hate to see it, don't you? Go ahead, scoop. That's all right. I'll put the salt on the caramel salt. Salted caramel. You know. All right. We'll lead out with the volcano. They play a tap land as well. Um, I think we go tapped as well. That way, next turn we can cast out the Raptor. Is this enchantments, no. Okay. Yep, Raptor. And then we need to get them into a trap. Hopefully they don't have another creature because uh, oh, 
not blocking that. You crazy? Ooh. As much as I want to play this right now. I need to do this right now. We'll hit the Venom. Draw, create pressure, swing. And then next turn, Ash and Neil, and then play with fire. Sounds sound to me. Okay. Okay. Right there, little. Ah. Ah. I see. Alright, we get the land too, so. Ash and Neil. Huh. Alright, let's swing. Probably should have did that before we cast Ash and Neil. Okay, they take it. Alright, we'll bottom that. Alright, now they're in a lot of danger. That's not enough. Yep. So humans. Alright. Uh, yep. And then finish it off with the lightning strike. keep this the other thing is we keep going first on the play which i am not going to complain about or try to downplay because we deserve it <laughs> i think all right blue green to start for the opponent a little mix of black in there all right let's like and strike that we'll swing it for one fine here uh, hopefully we can get the raptor out next turn. Okay, they have another trap forger. We'll just lightning strike that again. I'm playing very aggressive, which is not normal for me. <laughs> it's fine. Okay, they hold. We'll swing first, see if they want to kill it. Don't, but they're holding priority for some reason. Alright, they're fine. Hmm. Let's go to next turn. How many cards they got? 40? Okay. I thought they were like a 100 plus card deck and the whole thing is the descend or whatever. I mean, or have. <clears throat> Enough cars in the graveyard, but they only put back an island. I mean, a land. We throw a possibility. We chuck what? I'm actually going to kill that myself so they don't get that. Because then that just fizzles. It has no target. That seems to bust busted up their plans there. All right, and the virtue fizzles. All right, and we're starting to pull ahead here. Hold. Opponent probably has a, another virtue because we're within that space. They decide to play the blossoming tortoise. They mill a bringer of the last gift. Ah, uh, I kind of see what they're getting at now. It's actually a pretty sweet card. 
All right, what do we do here? Do we just kill the tortoise swing for four? I'm not opposed to that. Um, if they have another bringer, I mean, what is that bringer? Like five? At least eight mana. Ooh, they play the Takanuma. Let's swing. Hold up. The. Yeah, you're. you're man. You're gonna hate that. Thanks for hanging around. Here's the little nugget in the video. We changed the deck around. We're going from PEDs to steroids. With O'Hare Ashenil, you probably noticed there are two decks within the description. And now you know why. Here you go. Okay, next turn. Hopefully we draw into something good. If not, we just hold for when it, for them to play a creature. Now they played this life gaining one. Okay. They get the thicket. Alright, so yeah, we'll hold. Actually we can play the dire flail. Pass turn. Hold for whatever creature they want to come in with. Hopefully it doesn't put them outside of three toughness. Yep, there we go. How much is this to equip? One? Okay, we'll get the Charming Scoundrel out. We'll create a treasure. And that way we set up for Ash and Neil into the burn down the house. damage in while we can pass turn so they either play a removal here or they play um a threat right now this deck usually has really small creatures that just get big really fast let's see which way the opponent goes Play the cauldron and the soul cleaver. Okay. I think. Now that has to hit a creature in order for the ability to come into effect. But I guess they don't care anymore. All right, swing in. I mean, we got a good amount of possibilities. They could board wipe too. Let's not forget about that possibility. Um, now, if I'm not mistaken, it gets the activated ability, so that's a triggered ability. Okay. Yeah, I think we go burn down the house. Is it waiting for the trigger to come on? Oh, it's not a quit. Okay, so. Okay. If they block the devil, they're gonna. All right, there you go the smart route. Okay, that has to swing for the ability to actually trigger. And they put it on the Sovereign, which makes sense. Uh, we'll let that come in. Hopefully we can craft this. Ah, uh, man. Let's think about this. We have trample. All right, we can play another one. Quit with the all to the Ashenil. All right. 
All right, that way for sure. All right, let's see how they block. Uh, he's going to regret that. You have to block the Ashnail. Yep. Ashnail dies. Play the Viper. Hold. Next turn. Should be able to flip this. All right, they equip the 4-4. Four, four. Um, not sure what their next play is. <laughs> this gets plus three. Uh, yeah. I'll take seven. So I, don't, I think we don't craft this and we actually just equip. Okay, you're gonna take one. All right, what do we draw here? Right, looks like we draw land. Hmm. Okay. Huh. do this I think we'll have enough to flip the god mm, no I don't think so actually I don't have to think about it all right they kill us next turn right Oh, that was stupid. I should have swung out. But now if the devil dies from blocking, uh, their best bet is if they have another ossification or some way to get rid of the devil. That was my fault, though. I should have swung out. I didn't do my math right. Okay, he swings. We block. Is that gonna do it? Or is he trying to get the trample off? I don't know where he's gonna get trampled from. But... Um. Okay, so I think he loses here. Boom. I'll uh, keep. I think we leave with the Viper. Oh yeah, definitely leaving with the Viper. Make them have to deal with it. you there all right um let's go again next turn invasion let's swing out mm. actually now do we just do the pilot Oh, 
Now they have to deal with two things. Next turn. Can we do Astronaut and the invasion? Yeah, I think we can. Uh, sure. They sack of land. That's weird. Do we? All right, let's kill the. I mean, not kill. Uh, we can just pay the two now. Okay, that takes takes away their sack. Swing. I mean, shoot two here and then swing. Hope. It was weird that they sacked that land. Oh, they had another one. So they go to gain control of Ashton. I wonder if they're going to sack it at the end. Yeah, you got it. Yeah, they're going to sack it to the braids. I'm going to decline. You think about that. Oh, I can cast this danger for free, right? Craft it and then equip it. What's the equip cost on the other side? One? Yeah. Shoot him for one. Oh, craft with artifact. Mm. All right, we'll equip on the just plus two. Just plus two, no trample. All right, we'll put on the defiler. Swing with the defiler. Is thinking. Are they gonna sack that to draw cards? I wonder. Yep. Called it. Okay. All right. What's the big play they got? something oh hair astro knew is mean and was fun to play now he's very specific and i recommend you be careful when building around him because he doesn't go in anything now we're going to continue on our god jank to rank challenge but if you missed the last god challenge check it out here now, continue on with your day and go do great things.